Hello, this is a hard times guy. I'm making a little video here that I'm going to show probably over and over at the end of some of my videos. And the reason I made this is it's a good example of the kind of things you're going to find when you look at what the hard times guy has for sale. Everything in this video is for sale in my barn, including that mail pouch tobacco sign painted on that door assuming you got enough money. So look it over. If you see something you like, get in touch with the hard times guy because we got a whole bunch more stuff just like this. What you're looking at now is a little pump. And by my estimation, that's, that's just a sweet little pump. Look at that thing. Just perfect size to sit out in your garden and attract birds or Give you something to look at pretty in your flowers. It's got some great old green paint on it. It's got old hardware and just the right patina. They're just a, that, that little pump just got a lot going for it. And I've seen pumps like that. Price 100, 175, 200, 225. That one's not priced like that. I think that one's got a price tag on it for maybe $85. And it was in my booth uh, down to Antique Mall. And the girl called me the other day and she said, I got an offer on your pump. She told me what it was. The guy wanted to buy it for $50. And uh, I didn't tell him what I really thought of his offer because I appreciate getting offers. I mean, the guy obligated himself for $50. So I just told her I couldn't take that kind of a price for it. So then he thought he'd educate me and point out to me that the pump's broken. That little yoke up at the top that uh, holds the rod one side of that's broken, and I agree that it is broken, but I don't think the guy was going to try to use the pump. I think he was going to do what everybody else is going to do. He's just going to sit there and look at it so it don't make squat that it's broken. And uh, I didn't tell him that either. But it aggravated me to the point that it's brought my pump back home. I think I might have that brazed up there or what, but, you know, that pump's $85. Come on. If the pump had been not broken, I'd have wanted $150 for it. So, well, you're getting a little philosophy from the hard times guy. Uh, hope I didn't bore you with this. Remember to like my videos and subscribe to my videos. I'll see you on another day. Hi, I'm Peyton. The hard times guy is my great papa. Be sure to subscribe to his channel and give a thumbs up.